Hi, I'm Cody DeGalorians. And I'm Alex Giannini, and we're the program managers at the Westport Library. And this is 10 Questions with short video interviews with some of our favorite authors while they and we are stuck at home. These qu 10 questions are for Jerry Kraft. Say hi, Jerry. Hey, Jerry. Oh, wait, sorry. It's, it's been a while since I've interacted with people. Hey, everyone, how's it going? <laughs> So StoryFest fans will remember Jerry from our 2018 and 2019 festivals. And spoiler alert, he's coming to StoryFest 2020. Uh, Jerry is the creator of the graphic novel New Kid, which has won numerous awards, including the Newberry, the Calicot, and the Coretta Scott King Award. And super cool, it's one of Hoopla's featured titles this month. So if you don't have a copy of the book, please download it on, on your Hoopla on your device. So we'll just start. So what project of yours should people grab while they are stuck at home? Uh, well, you know, New Kid is still the big one. Um, so there are a lot of people that still haven't read it, but now I've gotten a lot of folks that are reading it with their kids, which is really cool. And some people are rereading it for the second or third time, which is pretty awesome. So how about a, a, a go-to book by somebody else that you're kind of digging on right now? You know, I am in the middle of Born to Crime by Trevor Noah which is really, really pretty cool. And picture book, there is Stu by Eric Velasquez. So those are the two that I'm into right now. What about a go-to album? Uh, you know, I'm like an old school guy and a best of. So I've been doing like best of anywhere from uh, Gladys Knight to Bill Withers, Earth, Wind & Fire, Sly the Family Stone. And uh, through a little queen then, because I got rehooked while watching the movie. So it's pretty awesome. How about, uh, what are you watching? Have a, a go-to movie or a TV show that you're binging? Um, you know what I watched last night was Invisible Man. And it was pretty good. Yeah, I liked it a yeah. lot. Uh, we were thinking about seeing it in the theaters. Or, but uh, some people have uh, complained that it's like, 20 bucks to rent but you know four of us watched it so that's like less than would have been in the movies and i liked it um we are also watching hunters on i think amazon prime which is pretty cool We've been bit. and we started something uh the one episode really quirky i loved it um Francis from elsewhere i think it's on amc so those are the that we're doing now what about your go-to beverage right now? You know, we are in a health craze now, so we're only doing water and, like, green tea and immune-boosting tea and anything that's got some kind of echinacea and ginger and all that kind of stuff. So it is the exclusive beverage of the craft household now. How about a, what's your uh, go-to work-from-home outfit? Uh, literally anything that, uh, I put my hands on because I do not have to mix or match these days. Uh, you know, if I were outside anything with my new kid logo, um, uh, but you know, I have not had to actually be seen by any people outside of my house in a couple of weeks. So, um, you know, at least this is clean. So that's it for now. Whatever's clean. What about a go-to place you'd rather be right now? Besides the Westport Library, hanging out with you guys, having pizza. <laughs> well, you know what's so, so interesting is that uh, if this whole thing had not happened, where I would be right this minute is in Beijing, China. So I had that, uh, a plan for an international school visit for over a year. And uh, I was supposed to be there. Would have been, I would have uh, probably been about now. That would have been cool. Yeah. All right. Well, so uh, as we all kind of deal with this, what's, what's been your go-to time waster these last few weeks? You know, I am heavy into doing the sequel to New Kid. It is due as soon as I can finish. Oh, the, the closest I come to wasting time is to stop to actually have meals or go to the bathroom. <laughs> so there is no time wasting 
uh, at all. Um, boys put up a little uh, bench in the backyard, so you know, so we don't have to go to the gym anytime soon. So I guess maybe exercise as a time waster, but there's really a lot um, less time to waste than normally. What about a go-to person you'd like to hear answer these questions? Uh, so like celebrity kind of person? You know, I'm a huge LeBron James fan, you know, both uh, personally and, and hoops. Uh, so I would go LeBron and, you know, I really miss Barack Obama. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see if so, we can get <laughs> Yeah, if you could get one of those two, that would be really cool. And tell them I said, hey, what's up? <laughs> um, all right. And so how about your go-to nostalgia bomb that takes you to a happy place? Oh, boy. You know, childhood, I would say both my own. Because I grew up in the Heights, much like Jordan Banks in New Kid. But we were like the little rascals, you know. Um, and there were like 10 of us. And we played stickball and football and uh, skateboard bike so that's always really comforting uh you know going to comic cons with my dad was always like a nice one and then with me and my sons when i used to like coach their basketball team those are like all kind of the, the warm fuzzy moments so how can people find you uh online or in social media while they are stuck at home uh see oh you mean other than other than right now Okay. Uh, so I am on Twitter a lot. Uh, my Twitter family. So everything's just my name. Really simple. So just Jerry. And that's right. And um, so my website, jerrycraft.com and Twitter and all that stuff. So it's pretty easy to find me. Awesome. Well, hey, Jerry, thank you so much for taking a couple minutes out to, to chat with us while we're all uh, you got stuck it. in our offices. Absolutely. Thank you, guys. Yeah, so if you want to find to check out Jerry's interview and all of our other interviews that we're doing, you can head over to the Westport Library's website at westportlibrary.org. Thanks again, yes. Jerry. Right. Do something when class comes out. That's the sequel to New Kid. Thank you. Thanks.